Hi, in this video I want to show you how to set up your game repository for PlayStation 2 development with Tyra Engine. The process will be really straightforward, so let's get started. Okay, so let's start from creating uh, your game directory. So we will go to Tyra repository and copy the template. Mm, okay, uh, maybe let's rename it. I already created on GitHub a new repository for our game. I can call it my PS2 game. So let's let's maybe rename it my PS2 game and add git here. So let's open terminal. So press shift shift button and open terminal and uh, um, let's type git init and we'll add the repository so let's add remote branch like, like or sorry or other origin yeah go to main branch and um, i think that we should let's see yeah add add all of these files and commit them so let's type git add that and git commit how we can name the gun maybe in okay and now we can type the push so let's go yeah let's refresh the page and as you see our game is here cool so let's start with the opening vs code here so i will open vs code and open directory my ps2 game code Mm. We will start from the configuration. So let's copy the, these, these three files uh, and let's do the same as in first tutorial. Uh, let's replace the IntelliSense path. We have already this in repository directory. So let's copy the path and fix it. And um, yeah, and that's it. Let's, let's close it and uh, let's open Task Explorer. Yeah, and as you see, uh, there are uh, all of the tasks uh, of our game. And as first, we should start Docker container. So let's do it. Okay, it's done. And let's update Tyra. Uh, this one will uh, fetch. Tyra repository to our Docker container uh, and uh, yeah and compile the engine. So let's do it. Uh, he asks for the branch. Let's keep it master. And yeah, we must wait a bit. Okay, uh, it's done. So let's try to run our game. So. As you see, it's a very simple template. Uh, it, it logs hello on init and loop in game loop. So let's run build task and see what how it works. Yeah, it works. As you see, it's spamming with the loop uh, information. So yeah, that's it for this tutorial.